dive head first Deep in that water like Michael Phelps Keep letting that lid burst He just want bodies under his belt Pills got his mind twisted he ain't YouTube, YouTube it's your boy XI No D, and I recently copped one of the best jump shots on NBA 2K19. Now I'm showing y'all a couple clips of me cooking up with this jump shot, man, shooting them big greens. Now I understand that this is just clips of me shooting, bro. This is cut clips. I'm going to show you guys two games of raw footage of me going crazy with this jumper. Now in one of these gameplays, I faced two lockdown defenders, y'all, and I ended that game against the two locks with a great shooting percentage, just like I do the majority games that I play in 2k now I am going to put this jump shot at the beginning of this video I'm not gonna be like every other youtuber because I know that's what y'all came for so off rip drop a like on the video don't forget to turn that sub button white to shoot green light turn on that big notification and we hopping straight into it bro as y'all see head over right away to your jump shot creator like every other jump shot video bro and here is the jump shot Lamarcus Aldridge Larry Bird released one, and last but not least, release two, Trey Burke. Now jumping into the blending and release speed, max release speed, animation blending, 50 Larry Bird, 50 Trey Burke. Now let's get into the raw footage of me going crazy with this jump shot. Let's go. So off rip in game one, the opposing team started with the ball. As y'all see, I got that big block. So now we have the ball and they only scored one point. And it is now time for your boy D to take over. By the way, y'all, if y'all are still watching this video right now, comment. G-O-A-T in the fucking comment section, bro. Big go. It only takes five seconds of y'all time. The reason I ask y'all to drop a comment on the video is just for the simple fact that I want to see who stays and watches the gameplay of me going crazy. And if y'all are still watching this video, bro, I just want to say big shout out to you guys for supporting me, bro. My last video hit 1K views in like two days, and I couldn't thank the ones that support me enough for showing love. Because that is all that a YouTuber can ask, bro, is that his fans show love on videos, bro. Like the video, subscribe, and drop a comment in the comment section, bro. I will be watching to see who's loyal and who shows love on my videos to give out mods for my live stream. Because in 2K20, I am once again going to take sacrifices and put my all into grinding this YouTube shit, y'all. So all I ask is that y'all get ready to come on this journey with me. Also, one last thing, I'm going to have to ask y'all for one more favor, bro, and it's very simple, alright? If you guys enjoy voiceovers more than live game commentary, be sure to let me know in the chat. Because I would strongly agree with y'all if y'all say that these voiceovers with the instrumental in the background is more entertaining to watch than just a plain video of somebody talking in game. So go ahead and drop your thoughts on that in the comment section. I promise y'all I read every single comment. Your guys' comments and feedback will do nothing but assist me to keep on improving my content and keep growing in my channel now let's stop all the chit chat and over commentate the gameplay that y'all are watching on your screen as you see my man i sell for clout did quit the game because i was going too crazy bro at this point in the game i had 17 points on his head and he just couldn't take any more of these abuses in that play right there i had to tell that man crack to get up coach now if only he stayed in the game a couple seconds longer to get put on his ass bro i believe that man would have been on that big suicide watch let me chill let me chill i do not believe suicide is a game bro i, I really hope y'all didn't take what i just said serious there bro because i do not i you know you know what i'm saying i apologize bro now do not ask what kind of shit i just shot i have no clue i thought i was a stretch big duke dennis overdose for a second bro but that was not the case man we are on defense he misses i get the board kick out to my man snags and look what snags does this man is a pure glass cleaner trying to shoot faders. Somebody get him out of here. And now this man, Ice Frosty, thinks he's a stretch big shooter from half court. Stop it, Budster. This man don't even got limitless range on bronze, and he think he got this shit on Hall of Fame. That's tough. Let me chill out with all the jokes, bro. As y'all see, the score is 20 to 2. I still have this bum-ass AI on me, bro, so I pass snags the ball. LT. Smooth criminal moonwalking on his bitch ass. Ah! 
Now moving on to game two. This is the game where I really had to go crazy for this video because for some reason, these two randoms felt the need to have to pull up with two peer lockdowns. And they were not just an average lockdown defender, bro. Y'all see, their records are pretty decent, bro. One of them has like a 70 win percentage and one has around an 80 win percentage. Part of me wanted to take these men serious because they were running two lockdown defenders. But then the other side of me did not want to take them serious because they are running two lockdown defenders. Who does that? Stop with the toxic shit in this game, bro. I might have to start praying to God every night that 2K20 doesn't have the toxic lineups and toxic builds that this game had this year. Because I am about done with it. Now, considering that this team is running two lockdown defenders, y'all, I am going to play this game out the smartest way possible. So, unfortunately, this game, y'all, they're not going to see me pulling hella shots because, once again, it is a lockdown defender guarding me and a lockdown defender guarding my teammates. So, I'm not forcing anything. This gameplay, bro, I was running with a stretch big. My man Just X Nags had left me because we lost the comp in the stage. So, I had to pick up a random stretch big man so I could get the rest of the gameplay play that I needed to bring y'all this bang. That last play that y'all see right there, I did shoot a green. I shot the three because I seen that he was behind me. He would not get a contest. So that was my first green three of the game. Now, as y'all see here, bro, in the gameplay, these lockdown defenders were not playing, bro. So my stretch big had the LT to get me the ball, bro. This lockdown defender right here, low-key was boxing my shit, bro. So I passed my man the ball on the cut, getting me closer to takeover. So when I get takeover, I could be different and cook this lockdown defender. And play by play, that is exactly what I'm doing. Getting closer to takeover, bro. I finally learned how to LT dribble glitch easily, hitting them with that Euro dunk. And now my takeover is activated, bro. These two locks fucked up giving me takeover, bro. When I get takeover, I turn into a pure sharp. I turn into a play sharp. I turn into a pure shot creator and any other possible archetype y'all could think of on this game y'all are probably questioning what the hell i was doing with my dribble moves right here i have no idea bro do not ask me do not add me it's that simple bro i just equipped a new dribble move so y'all already know that comes with a little bit of adjustment but as y'all see i'm pulling for the easy greens bro he thought i was gonna shoot that three on the left wing but i faded at the mid of the court to get that easy green bro now my fucking i don't know what this man what's his name Verks. My man Verks, the stretch big, the one and only, felt the need to have to shoot a three and put up some points on the board. I feel your pain, bro, because I would not feel good getting carried by a 99 every single game, bro, because that's just what I do. But look at that patch made shot, man. Big 99 shot creator on D, bro. If y'all going to question that jump shot, just, just think real hard about the time and hours I put in this game to be a 99 overall. I better make that damn shot. I don't care. I had takeover. I deserve that shot. And that shot too. Bang! And now here we are at the end of the video. Now, unfortunately, I did not record an outro of gameplay. So with that being said, it's been your boy D. Hope y'all enjoyed this jump shot video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you're new to the channel. Turn on them post notifications. Get that bell a ring a ding ding. And I will catch y'all. In the next banger. I got my young nigga rich in six months. Play with me, get your shit. No bus. cap. I'm on the tour bus, get my dick sucked. Buy a bitch with a big butt. Yeah. I like my hoes to be freaks. Uh, nice. Uh, Fuck all that going to sleep. Uh, Smash. Uh.